Hi guys, um, I have a terrible cold, so I'm sorry about that, but I just wanted to um, show you a little haul that I did this weekend. I bought some clothing and I bought um, some skincare and just a tiny bit of makeup, and I just wanted to share. I wanted this to be like a happy video. I'm very excited about the stuff that I got, and so... Yeah, I'm gonna show you. I'm just gonna go quickly through what I got from H&M. So first off, I got this sweater, which is has two um, colors, or it's like separated. This is from the Conscious line, and it's about, it doesn't say in dollars, it's only say, it only says in Norwegian kroners. So I'm just gonna say this was about um, $20. And the fabric is really soft and nice, and yeah, I really liked it. I got a few necklaces, I like a bunch of necklaces from H&M. I lo really love this one. Isn't that pretty? I really like marble stuff. Also, I got a bunch of rings, like these. This has some marble. Yeah. Bunch of rings, and I also got my earlobes pierced. Um which I haven't done since I, was, since I was like 15 or something. And so I need to get that done, and I did. And so I'm really, I'm really excited about y using some more jewelry or accessories from now on. So I also got some earrings, um, just very simple ones. This was like $10. They all, from H&M Home, I got some scented tea candles or tea lights. This was cinnamon scented. And I really liked the, the color. I got this. Um, so this pattern was everywhere at H&M where I was. They had it in like blouses and dresses and everything. But I got this really pretty top. It has fairly short sleeves. It ends about here probably. And it's a little bit puffy at the shoulders, but not not a whole lot. So I managed to pull this out off. And I can't really remember about $15 for this one. So I really liked the pattern on it. It was like flowery with pink and yellow flowers and like a black base. So I love that one. I got three pairs of jeans. The first one is this um, push-up jeggings, low waist. So this is probably too low waist because I usually buy all my pants in high waist. I do not think it's comfortable or pretty. Um, you to use a low waist um, pair of jeans, but these were I really like them. I really like the color. Was really what I fell for. It's like a light washed gray um, color, and it was about thirty dollars for this one. So yeah, and then I got two pairs of the same jeans, which was the skinny high waist ankle length skinny fit jeans. And these I bought mainly because they were super comfortable. So this was the darker one that I got, like a dark, or like a medium blue. And then I got one that was light. I usually don't go for light jeans. Um, I don't think they're very flattering and they're kind of dated, but I really like these ones. So I didn't care. I got them and they were like $10 a piece. I also got a little brown, very simple scarf. It's almost red in a way, but it is definitely brown, but like a, a warm brown. And this was also $10 or about $10. Really soft and nice material. I got another notebook which says nerd, an intelli 
an intellectual badass. Yep. Mostly just liked the pattern or like the marbled effect. I also got some eggnog tea because I've heard like eggnog is like a thing in in America and I have no idea what it is. It's probably something made out of egg and maybe some milk based but I have no idea what it is. So I bought this and I'm gonna figure out what the hell eggnog is. So if you guys have a, an actual eggnog recipe because it's, this is just tea so I, I'm guessing that it's not real eggnog. It's just like a, a little taste of it. I don't know. Can be a simple recipe if you have one, because I'd love to try one. I love to try um, food from other countries and drinks and stuff. So the makeup items that I got was um, also from from H and M. I got the Isadora Glossy Lip Treat Moisturizing Lip Color in Vintage Rose. This is what I have on today, and I really like it. And then this is the H&M Sheer Lip Color Moisturizing Formula with Shea Butter and Hyaluronic Acid. New formula, it says. So this was $10. This was about $15, I would say. Or a little, like $11, $12. Um, the color is in Misty Mauve. And it's so pretty. I really like this one. I'm really into sheer lipsticks. I don't like a full-on... So this is what it looks like. Really love this color. It just gives like a little hint of something there. Really like this one. So I'm really happy I got those two lip products. So then I went to Lush and I got the Coco Loco Shower Oil. It tastes like coconut and vanilla really. Butter Ball bath bomb this is what it looks like just very plain simple white one but it smells so good it smells like vanilla just marshmallow cake or something like that love it and then i got melting marshmallow bath oil yeah i like sweet scents in my bath and this is just like a tiny little cup. Oh, it smells so good. Love it. It also smells like a little raspberry. I don't know if this was right even. This doesn't smell more smells at all. It smells really good. That was everything from Lush. And then I got into, I went to Kix. And I've been really wanting, I got this little tester of um, Saint Laurent the what's it called black opium perfume and I really like the tester and I went in to kind of get the perfume but I thought it was really expensive and then I found this one I found the brushwork version and this was like $25 so I felt like I could let myself buy it so it's like you brush you click it on you click it and then you brush it on and the problem is that I have a cold and you should never buy a perfume if you have a cold. That's like common sense. Well, I did and I don't feel like it smells like the tester. Then I went home and realized that Black Magic has like five, six versions and I don't even know if I got the same one as my tester. So it doesn't smell the same. same. So I'm like stuck here with a perfume I don't really love. So that's great. And then lastly, I went to Rituals. Rituals is like one of my favorite brands when it comes to body and skincare, uh, mostly body care. And I bought a few favorites and like repurchases and then a few new um, products. So this is Rituals Foam Fiesta Playable Shower Foam in Flamingo Flower and Pink Grapefruit. Fruit. So I'm very excited to try this one. I'll let you know in like an empties video or something if I liked it or not. And then I got a repurchase. Um, this is the 
Ritual of Namaste Purify Radiant Glow Cleansing Balm in Hot Cloth in Moringa and Holy Lotus. And this is um, a repackaging sort of thing because this is not what it used to look like. It used to be like a tube. Um, you've probably seen it in my empties and it's definitely one of my favorite makeup removers um, or cleansers. I usually cleanse, like double cleanse with this one. It's just really, really good. And then it comes with a cloth as well. Oh, oh, listen, namaste means I bow to you. My soul honors your soul. I honor the light, love, truth, beauty, and peace within you because it is also within me. In sharing these things, we are united. We are the same. We are one. That's beautiful. Then I got this one, which is the 24 Hours Hydrating Gel Cream in Indian Rose and Holy Lotus. And to be perfectly honest, I bought this for the packaging. The packaging is gorgeous, I think. The marble on the bottle and it's just, yeah, it's just amazing. So I have no idea if this is good. I'll let you know. It's like a day cream. Um, but it was quite expensive and I have an eye cream that I don't really love from Rituals. I haven't tried a lot of their like skin skincare, but I just love all of their, their body care. So I'm really excited to try this one. And then always when you're at Rituals, you get all these free, free gifts. So I got this as a free, free gift. A oh, little, I can't speak today. Um, and this is the Ritual of Ayurveda. I don't know how to pronounce that. The Ancient Art of Living Wisely. So this has um, a nourishing shampoo and conditioner. I love that. With argan oil and shikakai. That's a really great free gift. And also, I got like a bunch of um, samples. The Glow Pure Radiance Face Oil and Anti-Aging Night Cream. A couple of those. And then I also got this um, SPF 30 Protecting Lip Balm in Shea Butter and Eucalyptus. And I... Hello? So again, I mainly bought this for the packaging, but I know I need a lip balm with an SPF for the summer. I mean, this is so cute and it had different colors depending on what kind of lip balm it was and you you push this and it, the lip balm comes out and it smells divine, like mentally and yeah, eucalyptus. I love this and I hope it works. Uh, my sister said it doesn't, so we'll see, but yeah, and Rituals is also cruelty-free. It's kind of expensive, but I just really love it. I really do. Um, oh yeah, and the last thing I got was this purse. This is a purse I bought in Zara. Um, I went in to try to find one of those leather blouses or faux leather blouses in black. I just love the look of them, but I, I couldn't find one that I liked. So I got this one instead because I need a bigger purse for for all my belongings. And this was really just a simple, easy, classic purse. It has just one big compartment and a zipper and that's it. Nothing, nothing special about it, but I just like the look of it and the purpose it's practical so that was everything i hope you enjoyed my little haul uh let me know if you want any like reviews of any of the products that i got and i hope you have an amazing day thank you so much for watching bye